Okay, after you've um, installed SQL and installed Myriad 5, the very first thing you're going to need to do is choose how you're going to license your product. So we're going to show you quickly how to do that on this video. Um, so I'm just launching uh, Myriad 5 Playout now. And the first thing you see is if it's an unlicensed copy, you get the, the choice of either doing installing a license or uh, continuing to ev uh, on an evaluation. So let me just briefly explain how the evaluations work in Myriad 5 Playout. You get four days of full unrestricted access to Myriad. So if I was to say continue evaluation now, I'd be on one day, day one of tw uh, 20 of my evaluation. And for those first four days, I could use it nonstop, no restrictions whatsoever. After the first four days, however, you can only run it in 30 minute sections. So you run it for 30 minutes, you don't have to restart it. So basically you can run um, on an evaluation license for four days. And the reason we've done that is so that if you had a problem with licensing on a Friday, for example, and you weren't sure if you'd be able to get hold of us over the weekend, um, then we know that you could run with no license for um, four days to give you time to contact us and sort out the licensing situation. Beyond that, if you wanted to evaluate the software um, on a just ongoing basis for a few more days, then you could run it in 30 minute segments. Uh, of course, if you're running an evaluation and you want a full license, you can still ask us for that and we can usually uh, issue you a full license for like a 28 day period. So if we don't have a license, we just do continue evaluation. But we do have a license, so I'm going to show you how to do that. So next, we're going to click on the Install License button. Okay, so here's the new install uh, license window. It's much, much simpler than the old one. Um, all it requires is an internet, um, internet connection and a license key. So if I have a quick look here, I've just had an email arrive from Broadcast Radio, which has got uh, the license key in it. So I'm just going to, I can copy that. Um, and uh, paste it in here and so there's my new license key and all I have to do is click on install and it contacts our servers and um, you can see there license is installed and will expire uh, on the 7th of um, October. Now one of the things that's different about licensing in Myriad 5 against Myriad 4 is in Myriad 4 we maybe license a month like this um, and then as you approach the end of the month it would start nagging you and it would be up to you to either uh, renew online or to contact us to renew uh, renew your license. But with Myriad 5 the system um, automatically licenses in the background. So uh, if you're licensing monthly, let's say you're on total subscription, you're licensing monthly, um, you will not have to contact us to get a new license each month. The system will just quietly renew in the background until such time as you either cancel your subscription, in which case we uh, we, we pause your licensing, um, or you know if there's some other reason why it couldn't get on. Obviously it will need an internet connection in order to do that. Um, let's say though you haven't got an internet connection and you still need to um, to license from us, um, then what you can do is you click on the save license button and if you do that it creates a little file which you can email to us or that you can go to our um, web portal and upload. It then um, validates the key inside that file and gives you a, a file back, which you can then um, load on using the load license button. So you only have to use the save license and the load license button if you are licensing your product and you do not have an internet connection. If you do have an internet connection, don't worry about it. You just click on install and from there on in, it will automatically upgrade, uh, update the license on a monthly, six monthly, yearly basis, whatever we've set. Final thing is, let's say you've purchased your product outright. So the system can then license for 10 years, just like Myriad 4, and it won't, you know, it doesn't need an internet connection in that particular state then. So if you have bought your product outright and you do not want to have it connected to the internet, then you do not have to for licensing purposes. Uh, of course, you also won't be able to use the Smart Info panel and various other tools within version 5 but if you choose not to have it connected to the internet it's not mandatory so that's licensing we should be able to close this now and the system should go straight back in and launch which it does so that's how you would license myriad 5